Heartland woman making her case. A $250 fine for illegally parking in a handicapped space. She says that's not enough. It is happening so often that she has police departments on her speed dial. Our Julia Fellow went for a ride with her to see for herself and has her story. Julia, good morning. Good morning to you, Vince and Susan. She says many people may not realize what that extra room next to parking spaces are for, for handicapped parking. She says she's speaking out for other people who don't have a voice. You learn a lot in a very short time with Michelle Groda. You have to speak up for yourself. The 28-year-old developed a rare cancer 11 years ago in her so spine. She is now paraplegic. That has never so held her back. I feel like everybody wants to have their independence. It frustrates her when she needs to call the police to get back in her own SUV. She showed us just how tight it can get to use that extra space for her ramp. She showed us photo evidence when things go wrong, like this time when she came out of theaters after watching Rogue One and even got stuck at the hospital. I feel a need to, to call the police because otherwise nothing's going to be done about it. She's programmed the non-emergency police phone numbers in her cell phone. Many times when she calls, the culprit gets away. One of the most common spots is in Waukesha. Police there back her up, sharing they wrote out 24 tickets to handicapped parking violators just last year. It's picked up pace this year with eight so far. She hopes you share her story. You don't know a lot about being disabled until you're living it. And so um, I just want to educate people because I knew nothing. I didn't know anything either. And maybe avoid a ticket in the process. And to spot someone who is illegally parking, you should check their license plates. If it has a handicapped parking plate, you know that they are parking legally. And also, you should see if they have a hang tag in their mirror. That means that they are parked legally. But if you see someone who shouldn't be there, including just anybody, Heartland and Delafield police chiefs I spoke to over this weekend tell me you should call them and they will go there right away to ticket them. They're happy to do that. Reporting live in Delafield, Julia Fellow, today's TMJ4.